We're here today at Huber's Orchard and Winery in Starlight, Indiana, taking a look at the Cuvée Smart Wine Bottle. This is how it works. You order each cartridge through Cuvée, which has partnered with about 14 California wineries so far. The Cuvée bottle fits over the aluminum cartridges and activates the valves in the neck of each cartridge, but only when you tilt it to pour. That way, though normally you'd be exposing the wine to air and it would start oxidizing in the bottle, with Cuvée it doesn't. Thus, the wine degrades over 30 days rather than the typical two or three. It's a cool concept, and from a tech journalist's perspective, it works decently well. But I'm no sommelier, so we came here to get an expert's opinion on how well this thing actually extends the life of an open wine bottle, and to see how well they do in a blind taste test. Do you want to talk a little bit about what oxidation means for wine? For us in the winemaking field, ox oxygen is kind of the enemy of wine. We want uh, as little oxidation during aging as possible, so we preserve the fruit character of the wine and the, and the flavors. So essentially what we're going to be doing here is taking you over to a table and doing a taste test, if you're okay with that, and basically taking a look at this device that helps avoid oxidation for wines after they've been opened. Do you think you'd be up for that? I'll do my best. All right, so essentially what we've got is three wines here. They're all the same, same vintage and everything. This right here is a newly opened bottle, and then these two are both three days old, but you don't know which one has been preserved and which one hasn't. Okay. So if you want to start off, you can just try that one and talk a little bit about the tasting as you do it. It's very nice. It's um, full-bodied, has good structure. It's a very nice bottle of wine. So if you had to guess between these two over here, which one was which, what would you think? The number two is the preservation system, and the number one is the bottle that's been opened for three days. Okay, so you think that number two is closer to the just opened bottle of wine? Yes. Okay. So number one is actually the preservation nice. system. <laughs> <laughs> you can see the, the color and the, the aroma of number two are somewhat more muted, and you get more of the oak and not as much of the fresh fruit. How do both of them compare to the freshly opened bottle? Uh, the aroma is just a little bit more uh, fresh in number one than number two uh, compared to the, the freshly opened bottle. Okay. Of course, the freshly opened bottle is, is, in my opinion, better than either one of the other ones. But. Uh, at the end of the day, the Cuvée bottle retained some of the flavors and the aroma of the wine better, but the other bottle retained other flavors better. So neither one really lived up to the newly opened bottle of Chardonnay. So right now for me, I'd have to pass on this product until the methods of preservation improve. For the people at Huber's who hosted us and participated in our blind taste test, we'd like to give you a big thank you.